Greetings, we meet again, and welcome to Birdsong in Bedlam, page to stage. In today's video, Colin visits Steve Billington at Rockfield Media to discuss graphic design for the show. I hope you enjoy. You just got to find the frequency yeah. that's tuned in. Well, I, I've done that on a number of occasions. I've done that all the time. I've done it here on a number of occasions when I've said to people, said, what you want to do and what you want to achieve, when you go into a pitch, you want that person on the other side of the table to say, why didn't I think of that? That's what you need so to do. The idea really is to, to get down there. I know we did some initial work yeah, on yeah, yeah, yeah. that kind of thing. So, you know, we're practically there really. It's just a case of structuring. So what do you need that when you send the show post? So how many of them do you need? No, I don't. I don't need, I don't need many of those. What I need is the design finishing uh, because they put them up on the electric boards outside, you see. Uh, so there, so uh, James Edgerton, who's the general manager there, who we're dealing with, um, he basically said, "Look, um, contact the people who are doing them and say if they get in touch with him, they'll give you the sizes yeah, or something, yeah, the yeah. dimensions." Yeah, yeah. And I presume you just send those digitally to them, and then they can go up. Yeah. Um, but then, obviously, we've got to provide we've got to provide for them two thousand leaflets advertising the show. Right? Not season. Yeah. So, well, it is for you, because <laughs> it's what you do. But, you know, I mean, so, we've we more or less got it. Yeah, we've we more or less got it. It's just a case of putting, like, dates on, stuff details, yeah. that kind okay, of stuff. Okay, we'll do that. The yeah. fact that you came up with linking those three concepts for each character that represent the seven deadly sins, yeah. I was really impressed that, to me, having an image with the name, having a tagline, and having an object that identifies with that character, like Morana's... Uh, hourglass yeah, 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 yeah. you tied that all together uh, in that concept on that poster and everyone I've showed that poster to they just get it straight away the image of those three things is very powerful because it tells you everything you need to know to be honest with you I mean, it, it, it was one of them things that just kind of happened I don't remember <coughs> sitting down thinking about what what shall I do? Yeah. It was more or less like, it was more of a, this is a good concept, it's a nice idea this, the fact that it's a, basically, what it is, is I'm taking one of the characters and I'm drawing from that character and I'm adding to it, yeah. to, 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 to kind of bring that character alive, because they're not alive until, until they're alive, are they? And I think it was that, but I can't, I, I have to revisit. The I mean, I think they did, you know, we started off with the concept of the picture with the name, yeah. and then I think you just add, you know, just added that, and then well, later, if, if you then build up this, and you've got because we've got seven characters, great. So therefore, what we can we can do is we can introduce those seven characters, maybe as teasers in the beginning, yeah. as the social the social media thing. I, I, I just thought that that was a that was a really really good concept to bring them to life, and you know, as I said, if you had. The, 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 the pull-ups or the, the signs as big as doors mm -hmm. going out there, then they become part and parcel of the experience yeah. Yeah. within yeah. within the, the, the it's what it's doing is is it's it's slightly hiding the the crawl. Yeah. But if you look at it, you go, oh yeah. This this, this is the, right. This is the, the striking thing. Right. So what I'm trying to do now is I'm trying to create some. Trying to create something that, that what about that if doesn't you put affect them slightly off skew birds on in sort of bedlam, you know, so they were just slight so bedlam could be like slightly that way and birds could be yeah, slightly, yeah. slightly that it, way. It, it, it'll work. The river is going through the Sort of the mountains, really. Um, do you know what I mean? So yeah. maybe if I don't know, we'd do it. But I don't know, we'd incorporate something like that. I, I, I think that or an emblem that represents that is that shorter in context to this other one anyway. Yeah, that's better. And you start sort of preempting and trying to make structure of it. Once you start structuring things, you lose the creativity because you're bringing in more of the technical side, you see. Yeah. So it, it kind of overlaps yeah. it. So what you've got to do is always keep that balance. So what I, I try to do is I just plough the creativity first. 
get it all down, you know, just open your mind to that download, all that creativity. And then when you've got all that, then you can go back and add the technical yeah. aspects and structure it right and, you know, take out the bits that aren't quite working, you know, to form a cohesive yeah. storyline. You know, but you've got, you've got to start with the creativity. You can't start with the technical aspects. No, and, and that's where people think, oh, well, you know, I've got to have, I've got to have an inciting incident and that, that's got to be in the first act and then the, in the third act that's going to resolve. And, you know, they have all these things that they've been taught that they have to build into, um, you know, a piece of writing. Mm. And actually what they need to do, you, you need to just start writing from a creative point and just get something down, put it down, you know. And then Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Remember to subscribe, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and tell your friends, tell your family, tell your neighbour, your pet, your postman. But remember, I'll see you next week. The truth lies within.